Sports. This is Steve Mingley, CKLW 2020 News. About 2,000 UAW workers have been turned back at the Fisher Body Plant and the Pontiac Assembly Plant in Pontiac by 500 picketing, busing opponents. Any of these vehicles that want to come through your line, you must let them come through. That demonstration promised again for this afternoon, and the flights are slated to reopen. So far, the GM workers have given up $80,000 in day's wages. And no marshals and no injunctions. That is the ruling concerning the Pontiac busing situation from federal judge Damon Keith. After receiving a report from a task force of federal marshals this morning, Judge Keith pointed out that the situation in Pontiac is improving, that 80% of the students are now back in school, and that progress is enormously encouraging. It was then that the judge ruled that he did not feel an injunction against protest was necessary, and said marshals would report to him only on the situation in the city on a day-to-day -day basis. Hopefully, that will end this weekend. Neil Thomas, 2020 News. Gentlemen, of here's near at Oakland Community College. The faculty meeting right now to consider a proposal from administrators to end the strike. In Baltimore, police have managed to force 200 inmates back into their cells after they attempted to stage a takeover of a cafeteria at the prison. And at Sing Sing, prisoners have been locked in their cells by their guards. They will not be allowed out till after the funerals of the nine guards killed in Attica, New York. And at that riot-torn New York State prison, two more prisoners have been found, both dead. Six are still missing. CKLW Winter News Time, 11.42. Sports. The Lions are cracking heads in earnest today as they get set for Monday's Minnesota game. Players think a big mental lift they got from the rough over Philadelphia will be a big help when they face the Vikings. A pair of aces go at Baltimore tonight. The Tigers' Mickey Lolich tries for his 24th win, while the Orioles' Jim Palmer goes after his 19th. The Birds still lead the Tigers by 10 games. CKLW, first in the Motor City with 2020 News. It took me a while to catch on, but now I know what all the sneaking's about. Every so often, Mom grabs the baby's Fiso Hex to wash those cuts and scrapes Junior gets. Then comes Daddy, and he captures the Fiso Hex for himself and back to his own shower. Says it gives him deodorant protection from shower to shower. Later, when he's watching TV, Mom sneaks the Fiso Hex out of the shower for herself. It conditions her skin as it cleans and protects. Even my silly brother is sneaking into the act. He grabs the Fiso Hex to wash his cuts and scrapes. All that sneaking around. I wish they'd get me my own bottle next time. It's not so CKLW weather just ahead of much more music and Pat Holiday. Sunny and mild, high 78, a slight chance of rain by tonight, low 54. Tomorrow, cloudy and cooler. Mercandex 78, medium air pollution, the current temperature 68 degrees. Sunny is 71, Cleveland 68, Toledo 64. This is Steve Megley, 2020 News. CKLW.